that Indian Sanskrit, the culture of our land is without words and without silence. And you can find out early morning that culture is practiced throughout the length and breadth of the country. I do not know, maybe uh, 2% or 0.1% must not be practicing because of the invading army which took over and tried to enforce their own ideology which doesn't suit our country. Otherwise, morning I saw in every house, I do not know much of the houses, but I remember the last uh, 25 years of Rakum school students' houses I go. Early morning they get up, they take their saliva, they apply it into the eyes. First, as they get up, they apply that some that is without words and without silence. It happens of its own. When you practice a thousand times, a ten thousand times, a five hundred thousand times, it strikes without thinking. It sees a gap. You do not have to look. The leg sees the gap and strikes. It doesn't even look at the question. Answer flows because that subject is there. It is a left, right, front, back is a front. Without words and without silence. And I have seen them, oh my God, you are still practicing. No, it has become a way of life in every house. They, they keep a bottle of water, room temperature water. And then immediately they drink, they chew, mm, they chew the water. Only then, for only then they go to the wash basin to brush the teeth. Nobody, nobody in India will come out without brushing their teeth. Especially Rakam school students, Rakam Ji Ashram disciples. I have seen them, that they brush their teeth beautifully using Colgate paste or whatever paste you can use it. And then they take the finger, they press the gums, gums 15 times in one one side with both the fingers, yes. And you can see sometimes a little bit of blood coming out. The gums becomes very strong. Dental problems comes down. And there won't be any stink coming out from the mouth. And after that, they take the water. They rinse the mouth. They spit it out on the left hand side of the heart 18 times. That will stop them from getting cold, cough, fever. And by them, they spit it out. Energizing is there, and then they take the yoga mudra. You can call it any mudra, your father's mudra, mother's mudra, but we use the term yoga mudra. Fourth finger and middle finger clamped on the base of the thumb, and then you take the nose, you, you blow 30 times in the wash basin or outside water. With, with that, you cleanse the path, you see. It's a way of life, without words and without silence. What is that culture? This is the culture, without a word spoken, they have cleansed the path. Can you believe? When the path is cleaned, the eye power increases. You, instead of seeing, you become an observant. And when you do the nostril blowout, you see the hearing power increases. The brain, cells lying idle, slow learners become fast learners during this examination time. And after that, they go and do the Kapalapati. And then the regular yoga asana, they clean the flow. They clean the flow by, by using a broom, Indian broom, coconut broom, this much size, so that you bend, you don't take the big one. Now the big one is standing and doing. The sun never sits under the British Empire, broke into pieces because the Britishers stood straight and shook hands. While well, Indians did the Shashtaka Namaskara. And the tall tree, the British, the tall tree, it broke into pieces in a big wind. But the Indian Shashtaka Namaskara, it was a long, tall grass. When the big wind came, it danced to the tune of the wind. And the Sanskriti remained stronger. They did by cleaning the floor along with the wife and children. Along, that is very, very important. Without words and without silence, the floor is cleaned, windows are open, allowing the fresh air to move inside. They lit a lamp, a, a coconut oil lamp or whatever oil lamp, they lit the lamp to move the viruses out from the house. Kathil in the Belagin, Tamasoma, Jodhid, from darkness to light. And then husband, wife, the family, grandfather, everybody together in the joint. They sing together a bhajan together when they light the lamp. Yes, a bhajan because 
the raga thala palavi is very important clarity to make it because before you speak you, it's not that you think a thousand times you the, the voice understand whether you need to give an answer or not for a stupid question for an inexperienced person you 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 become so clarified that when you open your mouth the people who hear the voice they know it is such a sweet voice after you sing that song the bhajan you can see the sun aditi devo power the sun rises from the east you turn towards the east everybody together with folded hands you stretch your body you stretch your by the time the body the blood flowing stagnant water stinks flowing water is fresh water the stagnation of 8 hours of sleep it has or 6 hours of sleep it has now moved very well you are looked at the surya open your body you stretched it out, you got a beautiful stretch. You allow the sun rays to enter into your body. All the cancer cells are killed by that. Then you do your asanas, your pranayama, whatever it is. Then you know it is from the left nostril. When you have a headache, it is from the close the right nostril, breathe from the left. When you feel very cold, you feel very tired, close the left nostril. From the right nostril, it's breathe for uh, five minutes non stop. Small, small things is medicine, yes. Let thy food be thy medicine, like hypo hypocrites said. And people have become hypocrite. Don't become hypocrites. Hypocrites and hypo hypocrites. They are backstabbing. Hypocrites said, let thy food be thy medicine. Your own culture without words and without silence. A monk asked, Fuketsu, without speaking, without silence. How can you express the truth? <laughs> Fouquet so absurd. I always remember springtime in southern China. The birds sing among innumerable kinds of fragrant flowers. <laughs> when you are a fragrant flower, when you have done all your samskriti, the birds come and sing, people come and sing. Means people come and offer money, people come and offer respect, people come and offer love because you have become the love, you have become the respect, you only become the money because of that one samskriti which you practiced. <laughs> yes, practice makes a man perfect. Forget Sopsa, I always remember springtime in southern China without words, without silence, we can still create a beautiful society. Without words, without silence that you make sure that you interlock your fingers and you stretch up and say ah every one hour every one hour yes every one hour every one hour you must get up from your chair Dean Ornish the reversal of heart disease the chief physician in the White House Obama and Clinton said as a cardiologist he said what is the cause of the heart attack sitting in one place for more than one hour after one hour get, please get up and move and you move, make sure this stretching is very, very important. So body, when it's straight, it's straightened up, all the dirt comes out. Constipation is the greatest po poverty of the land. <coughs> constipation is the greatest diseases. And constipation is not there. You make sure you drink. When you feel thirsty, you drink water. You should do water, not just soft drink. Two people you should not allow. When many diabetes patients came, come to me, I said, two people you should not allow them. In the house, white refined sugar and wheat products. <laughs> they were shocked. <laughs> they thought this, we cannot live. And one thing you should always carry in your body, 24 bar 7. They asked me, what? I said, smile. <laughs> Wherever you see. Smile is the biggest medicine without words, without silence. Without words, without silence. You can smile at the birds, at the trees, at the children. When you see a children, oh, very good uh, uh, frog. Oh, very good dress. Oh, very good um, hair. And then you clap because clapping helps you to create an energy level in the body. We clap. In our every class, children clap. You know, all the Rakum schools, they clap. Every 40 minutes, they stretch their hands. Nostril blood, they clap. And we go, of course, with the clap, cha 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 cha